I'm the producer of The Smallest Show on Earth. Uh, it's a new musical comedy uh, with songs by Irving Berlin. Smallest Show has a, a cast of 14 um, and a band of six, so it's a big show, a big set, lots of dancing, lots of singing, and lots of laughs. The cast is led by Lisa Goddard and Brian Capron. Well, it's basically about a cinema, the Bijou Cinema, which is the star of the show. It's a cinema that's inherited by a young couple and uh, they think they've inherited this fantastic cinema, but it's not. And it's about the struggle that they have with it to revive the cinema. The whole show um, is based on an Ealing comedy called The Smallest Show on Earth, shot in the 50s, starring Peter Sellers and, and Margaret Rutherford. Rutherford. Peter Sellers played my part, and that's the part of Percy Quill. The thing about him, though, is he, he has two loves in his life, and one is the projection camera, and the other is Mrs. Fazakali. She is the cashier, she works in the box office. She tends to do everything, as far as I can see. She works out the money, but also she plays the piano and has done since the silent days. When the show starts, I think Quill and Mr. Zachary are really coming to the end. They, the, the cinema not doing at all well. In fact, nobody's coming to see it at all, and there's a, there's a possibility of it closing, and their relationship is at odds. With the arrival of the new couple who've inherited the cinema, everything begins to come together again. nothing more to say. Well, we have Irving Berlin songs, uh, which they very cleverly melded in with the original script, which obviously wasn't a comedy, the film. The first big song really is, people would know, is Blue Skies, and it's the young couple who are seeing this wonderful life unfolding in front of them. There's a fantastic sequence where the whole place is done up. There's a whole montage sequence where you see before your very eyes the cinema brought back to life. Cares and, and Mrs. Zackley plays and she's, it starts off quite low key. And then on comes the band, on comes the dancing girl and it builds into this fantastic uh, number. Tom is Mrs. Bazakali's son, and he's in love with Marley. They sort of get it together. That's where we get stepping out with my baby. Which is one of the great Irving Berlin numbers. It's a really wonderful romantic song. When I, Mrs. Bazakali finally realised the person that she's loved all the years is actually Mr. I'll Quill. Tell you no it makes a show that lifts your heart, you come out of it singing the tunes, uh, you feel better about the world. It's a, it's a classical musical comedy of its age. It's funny, it's, it's warm, it's quirky, and it's charming.